Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and um, today I'm going to give you a little bit of a mixed bag of a video. I'm going to give you a writing update, a reading update, and a mini book review. So I am hard at work on my writing. I just finished my second draft of my second book, which is currently untitled. Um, I just wanted to tell everybody that because um, this has turned kind of like into my writing channel. and. I, I'm just really excited and I picked another editor, this being one of my friends, and she's gonna read through it and see how it flows and everything like that. And there's flaws and there's missing scenes, but that's what second drafts are. <laughs> my second draft of my untitled story is at 34,800 words, a little bit over that. And I'm aiming for when I finish the third draft, whenever that is in a few months, for it to have a little over 40,000 words because I want to get my books to get progressively bigger as time goes on. And yes, this is the second book in my series, so it will be the sequel to The Rose Petal, which I published in February. Um, so I am very excited about that. Now on to the second part of the video, which is currently reading. I am reading two books right now. I am reading What Remains of Her by Eric Rickstan. This is a novel set in Vermont, which I am a Vermont author, so I wanted to read a book set in Vermont. Um, it is a thriller, and the first chapter gave me goosebumps. I am 60 pages in. I'm trying to read about 20 pages a day, um, and I'm really, really enjoying it. It's also a signed copy. The second book I'm reading, everybody's talking about, and for good reason, the next book I'm reading is Children of Blood and Bone by Tomi, Tomi Adeyemi. Um, this was picked as like the first ever Jimmy Fallon Summer Reads book last year and that's how it got my attention. I had never heard of it before that and um, this year a friend and I were celebrating like Valentine's Day together as friends and she's like well what do you want for um, Valentine's Day? I'm like well there is this book and so she got me this book so I am now reading it. I am 31 pages in. We are actually reading it together and we set like a page a number of pages for each week and um, read that. So um, we finished the first few chapters uh, this week and we're gonna read more in the coming week. As for a mini book review, the latest book I've finished is When the Wind Blows by James Patterson and I really, really enjoyed it. Um, I don't read much James Patterson. I have actually only read um, one series of his, which is the Maximum Ride series, and I loved it. I read it when I was a teenager, and When the Wind Blows and its sequel, which I have not read yet, is connected to the Maximum Ride series because Max, the main character in Maximum Ride, is in When the Wind Blows, and I really, um, really enjoyed that. It was kind of like a reminiscing, like I enjoyed it more because I was reminiscing on this character that I had fallen in love with when I was younger. So it, it was a really good book. Um, one criticism I will put in there, it's not a big thing, it's just a style thing, is there was a lot of exclamation points everywhere to the point where it was kind of taking me out of the story because I was like, this isn't exciting or angry, so why is there an exclamation point there? Like there was just a little too many, but it was a good book overall. If um, you want something else to read and you don't know what to pick up, I would highly recommend um, When the Wind Blows by James Patterson. Um, it has short chapters, so you can read a chapter and put it down, and you can read six chapters and put it down, like it is, um, very fast paced, good book. And I'm sorry if I sound the way I sound in this video. I have been a little sick. This is actually better than I have been for the past few days. I did have a sore throat to the point where it was hard for me to talk, but now I can talk again. And it's more just like, I'm not feeling great um, right now, but I will get better. 
um, I have seen sunshine and flowers and I can hear birds again. So spring is fighting its way in. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.